Hi, I'm Carolyn from Tesla Kids, and today I'm going to show you what is under the Tesla skin. In the back of the chassis is the powertrain. It consists of the drive inverter, a single speed transaxle, and the motor. Let's take them one at a time. The drive inverter takes DC or direct current from the battery and converts it into three phase AC or alternating current. A three phase system is better than a single phase or two phase system because it uses less conductor material to transmit electrical power. The three phase system was independently invented by four men in the late 1880s, one of whom was Nikola Tesla. Hmm, Tesla, that sounds familiar. Nah, it couldn't be. Oh, it is! In between the inverter and the motor is the transaxle. It's an integrated axle connected to the wheels and a single gear that spins them round and round. And next to the transaxle is the motor, which is what spins the transaxle. The motor is about the size of a watermelon, and best of all, it's seedless. It's a motor melon. That's a joke. Let's now cover what's underneath the frunk. First is the air pump, if you have the optional air suspension. It blows up the air springs as if they were balloons. Next to it is an accumulator for the stability control. An accumulator is a device that collects fluid and keeps it under pressure as a means of storing energy. Next to that is the controller for the stability control and the ABS, or anti-lock braking system. Back here is the electric power steering. The Tesla uses rack and pinion steering. Rack and pinion means you have a fixed cog engaging with a smaller cog. And behind that, in the big silver box, is the air conditioning system. For cars with air suspension, here's one of four air springs. It's inflated by the air pump in the front of the car through a long tube. And here's the battery. The battery is four inches thick and it's filled with 7,000 small cells. It's wide and flat and covers the entire bottom of the frame between the four wheels. The battery and inverter are liquid cool with a reservoir and pump. And that's about it. Pretty simple, huh? Remember to subscribe if you want to learn more about the Tesla Model S. See you next time on Tesla Kids.